guys. Um, I wanted to go ahead and start off my first vlog with you with a very classic day in my life video. So I don't have anything too exciting on the schedule for today. I do have school starting this week, so I need to go ahead and clean up my study space that got destroyed after finals. Um, it is January 3rd, so I'm going to go ahead and put away Christmas, and I might go ahead and organize my vanity and show you a little bit of that too. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started on my desk. some of these other things on the desk are gonna leave. This is just my book stand to help me read textbooks while I'm at school without bending my neck and making it hurt and stuff. And then these are some books that unfortunately do have to go back to school with me because I start Elra again. But yeah, it looks like everything is nice and organized. I need to put up my new class schedule, but other than that, we've got our little Y, my postcard from my dad, my sign that my mom made me, the picture of Jack and I, and there's my mom and I when I was just a little one. And these are the two things that I need to find a home for. I definitely want to keep them near my desk. This is the career of the year from 2019, Judge Barbie. And I got her for Christmas from Jack's parents and I'm seriously obsessed. She's like my favorite. And then this I got from my sister. Um, see, she signed her name right there, Abby Jo 2019. She actually hand drew this and made it for me for Christmas. So definitely need to find a home for that. Thinking that I'll probably start moving my organization up the wall more, maybe a little out because I do have some of this space. So we'll just kind of see what works. Um, and of course, we have all of our mini brands displayed on my desk. So yeah, I think I'm ready to go with the desk, but just to be sure we're gonna go ahead and check on my textbooks first. Obviously, you already knew about these. These are my LRA ones that just continue over from last semester, with the caveat that I did accidentally buy the wrong edition somehow, so I had to get the new edition for this semester. Uh, this is my constitutional law book, which is pretty much the biggest thing I've ever seen in my life. So big, it just knocked over my brands. So that's upsetting, and I'm not looking forward to trying to show that in my backpack. <laughs> And then I've got Impeachment, a handbook, of course, with everything going on. Um, processes of constitutional decision-making, so it looks like it should be a fun class. And then this stack is Civil Procedure. We've just got the General Civil Procedure Supplement book, my Civil Procedure textbook, which is much thinner than I was expecting. So I guess that kind of makes up for the giant constitutional law. And then just my E&E &E for Civ Pro. So, Looks like we are ready to go, and I'll go ahead and get these loaded in my backpack so we can clear it back up my desk. All right, so now that my desk is nice and done, let's go ahead and start taking down Christmas.
you a little tour of some of our ornaments. These are some that we got this year for Mr. and Mrs. since we got married. My Nana actually had this custom made for us as a Christmas gift and there's us with Buddy and then it has our name and our wedding date on there. So it's super awesome and we love that. Um, this is from my parents, obviously, from our home to yours, Kenny the Roberts. Um, this one my mom bought us this year for our first home together, and it's cute because we had a little white fireplace. Um, this is one of my favorite ones. It's my best friend Tara and I. Uh, we both got these a really long time ago. I thought I had a year on here somewhere. Maybe it's on the box. I want to say like 2001 or something. Um, but yeah, it's one of my favorites. This pickle is because of the pickle game, not because I love pickles, though I do. <laughs> Obviously, that's buddies. This one is a really funny story, actually. My mom and I bought from one of these, probably this one, um, my like first year at UF that I had a Christmas tree, and it's because I love pancakes. I saw it, and I was like, I have to have that. Then the next year for Christmas, she gave me this one, and I was like, Mom, we already have this. But I guess that just goes to show that I really, really love pancakes, and I think it's so funny, so I hang them both right next to each other on the tree. Um, this one's obviously because I love baseball. These are from my little Allison. Um, she gave them to me one year as a Christmas gift, all three of them, and I believe they're all handmade. Not by her, I don't think, but they are handmade. And it's funny, because I actually just got another one of these from my sister this year, and she made this one out of yarn. Um, so that one's pretty neat. Obviously, I love food trucks and Princess Belle. <laughs> and then this one I didn't actually get because I got into law school. I got it like the first year I had a Christmas tree, and my friend came over and she saw it on my tree, and she said, is that the scales of justice? So yeah, a little bit of a nerd. This one, I made Jack last year. This is a vodka we really like, so I made the sticker on my Cricut from the label. And yes, there is actually vodka, but it's not this flavor. It's just one of those little mini things. I put some rivet around it. I don't know, kind of lame, but you know me. Grandma bought that one. I get Starbucks on Black Friday. Obviously, I love Disney. This is because my friends and I made K-Top and we love bananas, so shout out to Delaney and an artist. <laughs> And then we've just got some general Christmas balls to help fill up some of the space as well. And just because everyone asks, these are mine, they were not Jack's. Everyone is always like, oh, that's Jack, because he's the biggest Gator fan, but he's not the only Gator fan around here. Beachbody with one of my friends, Emily, who's actually a coach, and they're doing a bar blend challenge, and that starts actually on the 6th, so I've got a couple more days, so we're just working through our prep workouts, and today's is actually part of a yoga retreat, it's a three-week program, but I'm going to go ahead and do my scheduled workout today, so I'm glad to have you guys with me. start this whole new program. I have a bunch of girls that we're doing it with and Emily is an awesome coach so we're all really excited. I think I speak for all of us when I say that. But yeah that's pretty much a day in my life. I'm gonna go hop in the shower and maybe I'll see you on the next vlog. Bye guys! <laughs> 